Hi, I'm Joan and welcome to our exhibition here with the Gendebec school children and also some of my work. Okay, I, at school I often use children's literature as a basis for the artwork. So this year um, we've used Dr Seuss, you can see the cat in the hat, and this one here is a lovely children's story called um, El Kazoo, will not brush her hair. And also we've used the famous Australian story of Snugglebutt and Cuddle Pie. Children did illustrations of how they saw the gumnut babies and also the ACMN. And, and then we used natural materials for them to make little Snugglebutt and Cuddle Pies. So we also study a lot of famous artists and then the children do their own versions of the work. So we use the Casso and particularly his Blue Period. And we've got one version here, and also this lovely guitar piece here. Well, we study Van Gogh, and instead of doing sunflowers, we usually study, we did an in-depth study of Starry Starry Night. And this is just three of the pieces that the children did, using that as inspiration. Bingo. So, sometimes in my spare time, if I'm not knitting and making crazy beanies, I do a little bit of artwork, and I become an artist. I like to use oils. And of late, I've put textiles with them. And so when I've got something to say that I really can't say, then I can't. So with my pieces, um, what I want you to do is just stand in front of them and have a look at them and try and see what feelings these um, paintings produce in you, rather than trying to work out what my feelings were when I painted them. So I've been experimenting with felting a little bit and also with hand spinning. And then sometimes I use that to knit or crochet to make these little pieces that you see on my work. Um, I love felting, but I'm just new to it. <laughs> so I'm a bit of a beaniologist, which means that you make beanies. Um, since I found the Alice Springs Beanie Festival, I've been entering every year and also just making beanies for fun. So this year I won a prize, hippie. So hopefully you really enjoy the exhibition and come back more than once because it's open right until the end of July. So please bring all your family and your friends and your dogs and cats and your relations. Thanks very much for coming.